Hello everyone, it's me Liam and welcome back to another video. We are back on Croydon the transport game, a uh, London transport game, or I'm going to call it bus sim, on Roblox. And just look how amazing the 200 MMC looks. We're in the short variant because of the route we're doing today. It is very tight. So, uh, stop with this. Let's fire turn on the bus. Pressure, oh, fire system pressure, okay. Turn on the lights, interior and exterior. We're going to be doing the Route 450 today. So what we're going to need to do is just bring the bus back around. Because obviously uh, we're in the simulation mode. Uh, but yeah, obviously I wanted to have the proper startup and whatever. Uh, with the bus, it's very easy. You just press the key once. I pressed it twice by mistake. But anyway, let's get over to the stop to start the route. Right, so here we are. We're now able to select our route because, of course, I pressed uh, free row up there. You have to basically come back around. So it's the uh, Thornton Heath Mystery Tour. And if my mouse comes back up, don't matter. We're just going to have to do it with my controller for this bit. Press drive, you are good to go. West so. Bus station. Currently, currently stuck on something. Anyway, we need to get to Stand B here at West Croydon Station. We're just going to turn on our hazards because we're crossing over. Turn them off now. Uh, we've only got one door when it comes to the short variant of the 200mmc that we're on and they would like the day ticket and you would like a return Two. ticket Thornton so Heath, nothing bad and we're gonna get on our way just make sure we've got interior lights on they seem like they wasn't on it looks like we're gonna be using our controller because the keyboard holy shit you guys Oh my god, you guys gotta see the view up here. Oh my god. Uh, oh, this is really scary. I'm sorry for that. That is currently the Daisy chat going on. There we go, there's keyboard all sorted. Uh, I forgot, I was still connected to that, uh, to the Zello. I haven't long came off Daisy. Uh, I was streaming that earlier obviously looks like we can't disable that for some reason with the mouse and keyboard that's fine it, it just seems to be better suited if you had a steering wheel steering wheel would work with uh roblox but anyway first stop here at bedford mm -hmm. Uh, I'd like to say thank you everyone for the support recently in the videos. I've been trying to upload at least three videos a day. Uh, I've been doing at least Fair one 15, stream two, a day the past few days. Me, so road. on the 20th when I started recording this I did two streams. I did one on Twitch which was doing this which I would upload the vlog the, the vlog the vod 
when I get a chance to, to the channel. And then I streamed earlier on Daisy. Uh, I went back on it for a bit afterwards. Uh, after that stream ended, I didn't really get many people actually wanting to be picked up here, so it's a nice change. Hi there, you would like a return, there you go. And single. Why? Yes. Yeah, and thank you for the support. You've had 500 views in the last two days alone. So that puts me up to about 10,000 views on the channel, which isn't bad actually. I know I've been using the channel for quite a few years, but the past couple of months before uh, past week, really haven't been having many views. So thank you for everyone watching. If you're returning or new to the channel, go drop a like, put a comment down below. I'll Dead really like to see because obviously, I think train sim and this. It's going to bring a lot of views to the channel, and I think it's going to be very enjoyable for you guys. And I will bring Bus Sim, the actual Bus Sim game, over. What do you want? Uh, day ticket. Four fifty. Two, Thornton Heath, Parchmore Road. Same problem again. Just have to use the trigger for a second on the controller. So yeah, I'm using keyboard and mouse because my controller's got a bit of a stick drift on at the moment and it's a bit of a pain when driving. So we're using the mouse uh, keyboard for the time being. Well, that's nice and easy around there compared to last time I tried getting around there. Um, so yeah, like I'd be driving straight and you'd see that so I thought why not use the keyboard and it's doing a really good job. Road. Especially with using the mouse, it's just it's a bit easier to do stuff. Which I'm not complaining about as we're at Windmill Windmill Road currently. Uh, it's not really a long route, so we will end up doing a return service back Two. in this one. Thornton Heath, Parchmore Road. Uh, no, we don't want to leave the vehicle. Which is what I keep on forgetting. Normally when it came to me on OMSI, the space bar is the... Windmill Grave. Parking brake. So I keep on pressing that by accident sometimes, whereas you don't actually need to use the parking brake. Well, you do. It automatically goes on you see in a second it will go red where it says P when you open the door so it's not bad it's actually easy to use and a single there you go 450, the 450 seems to be to one of the most popular routes what, from what I've seen so it just clicks a car a little bit does get tight down here um, yeah, it seems to be one of the most popular routes when it comes to Croydon. So, it can get quite busy, you can get held quite behind. As you can see, normally you'd have time here to say, ah, oh, this is how long you got, or minus how delayed you are. Luckily, we're not a minute delayed, so it don't show that. But Currently stuck on a car, so we're just gonna have to reverse it for a second. But yeah, luckily it's not showing that, so. You can't, this is what I hate. I feel like I'm not gonna hit a car, but then I do. That's why it's a no stop sign here, because uh, you can go transparent. After a time, or from that time, uh, in this stop section, you can get removed from the section and respawn somewhere else. I've had it happen to me. Kimberley Road. Very annoying. Whereas if you actually stop to like a bus stop, you get 45 seconds and then you go invisible. Oh there, David. Get a wannabe looking person. You would like a month pass. And you would like a seven day pass. There you go, buddy. 450. Right. Now we're behind schedule because of those cars. So hopefully, 
we end up gaining it back. Fair Green Road. It is a short route. Can't remember what route I did earlier. That was quite long, but it was an enjoyable route. I think it. I cannot remember what route it was. Don't know if I did it on stream or not. I'll have to have a look back on stream. Yeah, it would have been on stream because I was watching the Man United game whilst it was happening against uh, Rangers. Just reverse it back a little. Thornton Heath, oh, it's a bit Park too close uh, when we stopped to that car. See, so we're on the verge of 60 seconds there. So we we'll have to speed it up a little. Next stop is back road. Just over point, under point two of a mile. Speed it up a little. Bert Road. This section is actually, weirdly enough, a 30. I haven't seen any signs to state otherwise. As of yet, you want a single? Thank you, single. Oh, shit. Silly me. Four fifty. Two. Yeah, how many guys? Um, road. I'm going to load this one as soon as I'm done with recording it. I'm going to add my intro to it. I'm going to make a outro, which is involving buses, for some of the later videos. Oh, getting a bit close. I think it might have been the uh, 296 that I did earlier, I think. Torridge Road. I'm not 100% sure. I generally have got what route I did do earlier. Hi there, little Nas X. You want a single year you can, man? A single as well, bro. 4.50 to Thornton Heath, Hutchmore Road. So we're going to be turning right down the end of this road. And also, I did record this video already, but I had a little mistake coming on the return. I forgot to slow down and I went straight on and had a little bump. Thornton Heath, Library. Uh, someone didn't see me with my hazards, so I was reversing back down to get into that other road. So I was, went straight on and then I reversed to go back in. This guy just drove straight into me and I was like, oh. So obviously you need uh, Croydon Plus to to play on simulation. Thornton Heath, like Parchmore Road. 55 bucks a week. I had 50 spare because of Boy It's Summer. I've got a train on SCP. Oh, SCR. SCP. SCR. Which I will start recording as well. Maybe tomorrow I'll bring out an SCR video. Uh, have to see on that. You want a single as well? You want to return? There you go. 4.50 to Thornton Heath, Parchmore Road. So we've got 30 up here. We've got a station just uh, stop just after the hill. So Thornton uh, Heath Station. Power. Go back on it. Because you do speed up quite a lot. There we go. Hello. You want a day ticket? There you go, bro. You want to return? There you go, madam. 4.50 to We departed on time. We we'll turn left down here, which is final stop. That's what I mean. It's a short one. I'll we'll see what other services Parchmore we can do Road. from here, actually. So, I think it might have been from here that we did the one oh, that service from that I was on about. Yeah, collisions only are disabled at termini termini stops. And also Thornton Heath, Parchmore Road. This bus terminates so here. Start to Please between. take your belongings with you. So I believe I did Trying to figure out, and that was apparently 19 minutes, but it wasn't.
I'm going to do the M250 as well. Thornton Heath, Parchmore Road. Hi there, buddy. You want a day ticket? There you go. Single return. But yeah, just like, I'm going to show you this model. Look at how detailed it is. Like, you've got the reflectiveness, like, you've even got the indent. Like, I remember when people started doing buses on Roblox, what, 2018? They started doing bus sims, and they all just looked like rectangles with just like a 2D version of this on the front. Anyway, we've got to turn this round here. Nice and steadily. And it looks like we're going to be turning back on ourselves. I wonder if the 296 doesn't actually come from down here then. I thought it did, but it might not. Go. Let's let these guys on. You want to return? There you go. Obviously, in London, they automatically tap their cards, but N two fifty. For some Two. reason, you have to do it. Holes. I get that's why, because you get your credits for it, but it is a bit annoying. So keep that off. We've got one second to go. The only reason why I took it off is because. We put it on originally, but it stays on because of the door. But yeah, this is what I mean. I'm not putting any power on. This is how fast it goes down a hill. Brook Road. It's shocking how fast it goes. Right, here we are. Back at Brook Road. Open the door. Hello there, single. Return. This one's going to be a day ticket. No, return. <laughs> I was wrong again, but yeah, the amount of detail that obviously goes in. Two. Oh, there's tons of buses. There's tons of different variants of each buses, and this is that. Obviously, you got trams as well. You can do taxis. We used to be able to do taxis. I don't know if you still can. But yeah, we're going up to Norwood Junction. So basically, is it Norwood Junction that we're going to? Uh, we're going to Croydon Town Centre. Oh, we're probably going to Croydon Town Centre and then we go to Norwood Junction. Probably why it takes so long. I wish you can like press like this and it comes up with a timetable. That would be cool. Very cool. Bencham cool. Lane. Bencham Lane. Yep, you both can come on. Let me just stop my bus. Uh, single and return. Return, single. It's the wrong way round. But yeah, um... N250. Two. Fairfield Halls. That about ain't quite working at the moment. Right, I'll shut the doors in four seconds. Three, two, one. Okay, you basically just don't. If you want to have it on time, don't do it for this timer goes off. Do it after timer goes off. If you want to leave, you get a bonus. If you didn't know, you don't know. White horse money. On Roblox, uh, Roblox, Roblox. Until it's quarter past twelve in the morning. Been up since five. Uh, month pass. I'm gonna go to bed after this. M two fifty. Oh, I did that too early. Fairfield Hall. Oh, 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 we're having a problem. There we go. We just had a bit of a problem when it came to the keyboard. It just stopped working for a second. I don't know if that's just me or it was just the game bugging out. The only reason why I haven't done a um, Stepford Connect London Road video yet is because 
blue screens my game at a certain stop at the moment. So I'm basically just waiting for that not blue screen to do a video. Seems to only be when um, N250. I'm driving if I'm a passenger, it seems to be fine. Halls. Which is really strange. But if that's the way it wanna be sometimes, that's the way it wants to be. I just made myself an 81 player pick on FC24 on the mobile app. Let's see what we get. Oh, uh, we get Spitzer. No promo card in there. There is 84 by 10s and 85 by 5 best of batch 1 uh, footies re release at the moment. Which I definitely want to do, the re-release 85 by 5 I think that's going to be really good. Because of course you've got Team of the Year, Team of the Season back then, and then Team of the Year Icon Ronaldo as well. Like you've got so many good cards, plus footies as well on top of that. But I really want to get that 99 Harland and then that 98 Garincha. I think that 98 Garincha is going to be really good. Apparently Harland is really bad from people that's done XP glitches, but I don't know if that's just them. They weren't actually playing the game. It was just a loot video on a stream and it weren't really showing much. So it could just be someone's edited a video like really well. M250. Two and they just make it look holes. really well and make it believable. Croydon Hospital though next, so we're not, I don't think we're going to West Croydon on this route there, the bus station at least, we'll see, I haven't done the 250. 250 wasn't what we did in the end, actually, that's lie, it, it was the 250 that we did. I think, because I remember it comes Croydon Hospital. I think. No, it was the TR3 tram replacement, was what we were doing. Now I remember. It took me a minute to really clock on what we were doing. N250. I'm not going to run it on time. Halls. We're going to be waiting around too long to get it on time. She's a bit annoyed. But obviously, London gets a lot of time for buses because, of course, how busy it is, especially central London. Croydon's quite, it can be okay at times. But obviously, I've only been on the bus really Road mainly Green, in central London when I've gone London. Uh, or I think I've been on the bus once or twice in, in, in Croydon. Wrong button. Most of the time I'd either be catching M250. underground, overground, Two. maybe a southern Wars. service back into central London from like Croydon area. People this on Croydon, but Croydon's actually a chill place. <laughs> and obviously it has a lot of unalive things happening. But when it comes to like nightlife, it is pretty good, especially like um, for music and whatever. Croydon is the place to be in London, apart from if you want theatre and then you go to the West End, obviously. But Sumner Road. outside of central London, it's probably one of the best places. Me thinking about someone being on the live, that was outside Stratford uh, station, I think. I can't be wrong, it is a M250. while ago, but I feel sorry for the kid that, had, uh, that happened to. It's something that shouldn't be in the world, but you're never going to stop it. 
Montague Road. But yeah, honestly, guys, thank you for all the support recently. Like, we've got over 10,000 views on the channel now. And we've had 500 in the past few days with the regular free upload today. We had 50 people watch the stream balls. earlier, which was good. On YouTube, anyway, we had about 70 on Twitch whilst doing this. So, that was good. I did turn on AI traffic, but for some reason, it doesn't seem to work when you go into the settings. In the main menu, you put set traffic. It don't work. Oh, we do go to West Croydon Station. I don't know if that's N250 the train station. To Fairfield Halls. Oh, yeah, that was West Croydon. Anyway, Poplar Walk, next station. You'd go down there to the bus station, obviously. And same with here, this takes you at the bus station as well, kind of thing. Yeah. Poplar Walk. I'll show you what I mean in a second. So here, you turn down here, uh, you go down to the bus station, which where we started this video from. N250. To Fairfield Halls. So yeah, if you used to do the 166 service from South Croydon Garage, you'd come down here and down there. Well, from here to down there. And then obviously you'd go obviously that way. We have stopped for a minute just to follow the red light. Obviously you have to follow the rules of the road in the simulation one similar to how on if euro truck if you play truckers mp in the simulation one you cannot cause accidents unless it was a general accident you can't do it on purpose and it can be quite busy and it's more enjoyable of the servers on euro truck because you get a lot of people on Single, return, single, single. There we go. We got it. Got one out of two. N250. Two Fairfield Halls. We'll have a check where Fairfield Halls is when we get to the next stop. So obviously, you got the map up here, uh, but I don't want to use it whilst we're driving, you know, be a bit stupid. Also, stupid question, what did you guys think of the uh, intro uh, whilst we cut between just the part in West Croydon just to sort out the timetable to get back around and park up nicely at the stand? Road. Took me about five minutes, it's not my best work I guess. Uh, I'm quite interested to that. If you include getting all the videos for it, it's probably about 20 minutes. If not a bit longer. That scenario, uh, I thought I was going to stop it to check Fairfield Halls. N250. To Fairfield Halls. Oh, it's the next stop. Silly, mate. So we've done the 450 N250. We may do a service just back to West Croydon. And then this 166 to South Croydon Depot. I think that seems about right. I think it gives us a nice lengthy video, doesn't it? So I do like short videos. But at the same time, I don't log short videos. Fairfield Halls.
Also, do you guys prefer the videos which I haven't commentated on, like how or talked on, like how I'm currently am, or do you prefer the ones while with me talking? Obviously, I do have my mic issues at the moment. I'm gonna hopefully sort them out soon because for some reason my headset goes really echoey, so I have to use my there microphone, and my controller. So it can this be bus a terminates bit here. Annoying. Please take your belongings with you. Uh, we're going to do the 75 to Norwood Junction now. Fairfield Halls. So we're just going to park up here. I thought we could get a service back to uh, West Croydon, but obviously that'll probably be from the other side. But that's fine by me. We go up to Norwood Junction. I was watching a video earlier and um, someone now just a Renault McCaffrey. Uh, it was about talking North about TSW5 Fairfield and what they'd like to see with like the releases, like the base game um, that comes out. And obviously they had a line in Germany, a line in America, it was this one, this Fenton line or something, I can be wrong, I cannot remember that bit of the video. But there was like, um, I have two options that I think we may see with it, and it would probably be very popular with, of course, we haven't really had anything on this side of the UK with the main line. And they were like, it's like, can you class the Liverpool to crew steam line? No. That's what they said. Because, um, of course, that's based in the 1920s or such, the steam trains. And it was like, um, I'd like to see the non realistic option be the West Coast Main Line South. Because, of course, you can tie in Vanty trains to Birmingham Cross City Line and also you already have quite a, uh, the 380 sounds are from a 350 so it was like you got that 75 and obviously we haven't North had anything Junction. really on the west coast that's my that was his unrealistic option or a later add-on to the uh Trends of Mod 5, if obviously if this year Trends of Mod 5 does come out, because they do say last year Trends of Wild releases is every year, like how Trends in Classic it's an update every year. And he was like, the more realistic option would just see the Trent Valley line, obviously, from rugby up to Stafford or maybe even Stoke on Trent. Because, of course, majority of the rugby trains go up to Stoke or up to Crewe. Things like that seems to be the most realistic option. Maybe see up to Wicked Stafford Center. or push it a bit up to up to uh, Stoke. So obviously, it gives you the opportunity to have commuter services and express services because one, Avanti run up and down that line. Stop at Stafford and Norwood Junction, and also you've got London North Western Railway, which you kind of already have. You have West Midland trains across city, plus you already have the licensing for Avanti because they're in the livery editor, the logo, and basically wrong button. Uh, and they said, obviously, what you could do. Uh, with the train, uh, there's some German train that you can have in like a Ducks edition. Let's have Pendolino, uh, Pendolino in. And then you can layer that into the Cathcart line. Because of course, Avanti run up to Glasgow Central. West Croydon bus station. I'd love to have a Voyager there. I, I don't have the only two diesel, well, non have three because one it's the Steiners included. 
that, but I have. Do we put that into the station? Looks like we do. Um, I have only two, apart from the Steiner, non electric trains, and that's the 170 and the Class 66, and I can say the 801, because that runs on diesel as well. Hey, everybody. I see single. Oh, damn. 75. To Norwood Junction. Looks like we're coming back out on ourselves. By the looks of it. So we do go back to West Croydon, I guess. If we see a depot when we go to uh, Norwood Junction. On the way there, we'll end up the video there by driving there. Come on, buddy. Single, return. Oh. Bowls. Press the wrong one. Basically the same price in London anyway. To Norwood Junction. Next stop. Garth. Press it. Oh, back on the 450. Yeah, the uh, 380 is actually a really nice train to drive. No, I didn't watch the um, July roadmap video where people asked the question where they got the sounds from, but I knew straight away it was from a 350. That's the thing, I knew straight away it got. Didn't watch any videos on it beforehand. I started up, started going, I'm like, this is a 350. Right, they're, in, Road. It, they're all desiros, the 350, the 380, the 160, 358. They're all desiros. <laughs> they're the same from model family of trains, at least. So they probably have similar motors. See, with me, top two, Sound and electric trains for me. It's tied with the Zorro family sets of trains and the 323. I thought I'd turn that off. Obviously, Beaconsfield Road. Nope. No one's got one into off because the bow come up. Is that last new road next? Let's have a look, see where we are. We're not far. Probably about 10 minutes, Max. I don't think there is a depot going up to North Junction. Even South though there is on OMSI. But yeah, this is really good. If you guys haven't played it, I suggest you do. It is really good. It's well detailed. Like seventy-five. You look at the whole model in here. To Norwood Junction. It looks great. Obviously, the speed on the rev counter don't work, but that's understandable. It's roadblocks. So it's not going to be mapped. Let's put the foot down. See how fast we can go. Salhurst Station. Surprised no one's getting on from Salhurst Station. It is or, uh, 25 to 1 in the morning, I guess. So that probably be what? It's kind of like I've been for 20 hours, or like 21 hours almost. Been a very long day. Anyway, we're not the one up up that didn't see that. Not far from Norwood Junction. Time just seems to slip by at the moment. Park Road. No, no. But imagine if 
I wouldn't be surprised at some point someone tries to recreate the whole of the London network. Not well, at least the bus network. I tried playing that uh, DGBN underground line thing, but apparently, because my account is, it's, it's not under 100 day, days old, but because apparently it's 100 days old, I can't join. So I can't play the best London underground game. And it's really annoying. Russell really Court. Yeah, when I want to get a PC again. Give me a little PC. I'm going to see this. By using the uh, mouse, by going up and doing that. And trying some classic. Because I miss trying some classic. Probably miss Omsi more than trying some classic. South Norwood Clock Tower. Oh, last stop. Could just do that, press W and S at the same time it saves having to just just do that, that's just easier. Portland Road. There we go. And that is the Portland end of the route. Let's see. This bus terminates here. Please take your belongings with you. Shall we see if we can find a down? Yes. Turn right down here. We'll find a, a car park to park up in. Guess we'll park somewhere to the right here. This seems a suitable place to park with all this great concrete over here and there's some red bits here, so I assume buses do park it. Anyway guys, it's been me, Liam. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. You can see more Roblox, Croy, Croydon bus sim, or any other bus sim or train sim like SAP or Canterbury districts, which I'll show you what I'm on about. Let me leave. Put in comments and like this video, share it, please. I want to grow bigger. I want to get 100 subs by the end of the year, at least. Because how can we have 10,000 views? If we've got any 60 subs, it, it just shows how good people are. Uh, LNE is also another London one, but yeah, Canterbury, uh, Project Birmingham is another one. Uh, that's what I tried joining. I'll show you what I mean. You watch it works now. No, you were kicked from this experience. Your account must be 100 days old. No Cleons allowed. So yeah, that's what I mean with that. I really love the look of that, but apparently I can't play it. And then SCR and British Railway is another good one. But yeah, I'll see you all in the next one. That's the thing.